Hello and welcome. You are watching Gravitas Plus. I am Molly Gambhir. This week marked a historic moment for India. Shubhan Shukla is now a name etched in our minds and hearts. After 41 years, India has an astronaut in space after Rakesh Sharma's historic 1984 space flight. A proud moment for every Indian and a major milestone for India. Indian Air Force Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla, the first Indian to reach the International Space Station. As he greeted everyone from space with a Namaskar, the hearts of Indians were swelling with pride. Namaskar, my name is Desh Vasiyo. What a ride. After 40 years, we have reached the back of Santrich and it was a great ride. At this time, we are going to the back of 7 km per second. We are going to the back of the back of the back. And my friend is telling me that I am not. 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 I First message to India from the International Space Station. I think this was this was fantastic. This is wonderful, and I'm very very confident that the next what Indians are going to be amazing, doing as you said, advancing science and research, and uh, working together. Thank you so much. Mission and lift. The landmark private space flight launched from NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. The Axiom 4 mission, carrying Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla and three other crew members, docked with the International Space Station. To put it simply, the International Space Station is a space laboratory where scientific research is conducted. It is bigger than a six-bedroom house, equipped with a gym and a 360-degree view bay window. A gym, you ask? Well, it's a necessity out there. You see, working out is extremely important to mitigate the loss of muscle and bone mass in microgravity. The space station has been continuously occupied since November 2000. In fact, it makes 16 orbits of our planet Earth in 24 hours, traveling through 16 sunrises and sunsets. Spacewalks are conducted for space station construction, maintenance and upgrades. The Axiom 4 mission, carrying India's Chubhanshu Shukla and three other crew members to the International Space Station, has been an eagerly awaited mission. The mission also underscoring India's bold ambition to lead in global space exploration. With Chubhanshu Shukla serving as mission pilot for Axiom Mission 4 to the International Space Station, Shukla's role as part of the mission also highlighting India's growing prominence in the global space community. Focusing on operational readiness, microgravity adaptation and advanced scientific experiments in space biology and life support systems. In fact, his work will include pioneering studies on edible microalgae to explore their growth under microgravity and space radiation. In fact, this will mark the most research-intensive Axiom Space mission conducted aboard the International Space Station to date. NASA and the Indian Space Research Organization have collaborated on the mission which will include several scientific investigations, key research areas including studies on muscle regeneration, the growth of sprouts and edible microalgae, the survival of tiny aquatic organisms, and human interaction with electronic displays in microgravity. ISRO's experiments include crop seeds on the International Space Station. What exactly is that about? To put it simply, it aims to understand how crops may be grown in space for future exploration missions. The experiment will investigate the impact of space flight on six varieties of crop seeds. An ISRO experiment will compare two strains of cyanobacteria to investigate growth rates cellular responses and biochemical activity in microgravity. The results could help with the development of future spacecraft life support systems. Another experiment will investigate the physical and cognitive impact of utilizing computer screens in microgravity. The results could inform future spacecraft computer design and interaction. 
Another ISRO project seeks to identify molecular mechanisms of resilience. How will that help and what does that mean? In understanding the limits of life in extreme environments, this knowledge could inform future space exploration and help develop biotechnology applications on planet Earth. Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla was handpicked as one of the four astronauts for the Indian Space Research Organization's historic Gaganyaan mission. India's Gaganyaan program is India's flagship initiative for indigenous human space flight. It aims to develop and validate technologies for safe crewed missions. On February 27, 2024, the Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi announced Shubhanshu Shukla as one of the elite astronauts undergoing intensive training for India's maiden human space flight mission, Gaganyaan. And in August 2024, Shubhanshu Shukla was selected as the prime astronaut for the mission to the International Space Station. Born on October 10, 1985 in Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh, Shubhanshu Shukla's journey began when he was commissioned into the Indian Air Force Fighter Wing in June 2006. And his ascent to the rank of Group Captain in March 2024, reflecting his exceptional contributions. India's space sector has experienced significant growth and achievements over the past years, marking a new era of innovation and exploration. Shubhanshu Shukla has carried over a billion dreams and India watched on with bated breath as he took this giant leap into space. With the Axiom 4 mission also setting the tone for ISRO's own Gaganyaan mission, in another huge moment for India, another reason to cheer, Dengeti Janvi from Andhra Pradesh has been selected for a historic space mission to the Titan Orbital Port Space Station, expected to launch in 2029. With her selection for this mission, she will be among a select group of astronauts contributing to the next generation of off-Earth infrastructure. With these inspiring stories and giant leaps, conquering the final frontier, realizing dreams, huge milestones in India's space journey, taking the country to newer heights.